Hi, it's Shane here from ITTN, and today I'm coming to you from Onboard Celebrity Beyond. So stay with us over the next few minutes while we take a look at this magnificent cruise ship. So I'm absolutely delighted to be back here on board in the Celebrity Cruise Ship. Obviously, there was a bit of disappointment when Apex was launched during COVID, so none of the trade or agents got to experience what it had to offer. But here, we're at last on Celebrity Beyond, and it, my God, it's been worth the wait. So Celebrity Beyond has an additional floor to what the Celebrity Edge has. It's a slightly larger ship with roughly 10% more passengers on board. The ship has an additional 20 meters, so it's that little bit longer. And a lot of that space has been put together in the Sunset Bar, which is a stunning bar at the very back of the ship with a really nice feel and relaxed vibe to it. So here behind me, you can see that the famous magic carpet cantilever platform is just behind my shoulder. Again, during the day, that works as an extension to the pool bar, and then come nighttime, it's an extension to Raw on Five, the seafood restaurant here on board Celebrity. With over 30 different places to enjoy food or drink on board Celebrity Beyond, you're spoiled for choice. But one of my favorite perks is the fact that they have four different main dining rooms, giving you a different feel every single night. So I'm coming to you from now in the retreat area on board Celebrity Beyond. It's very calm, very tranquil, a perfect place to chill out and unwind. And the main difference being on Celebrity Beyond, the retreat is based over two levels as opposed to one level on the Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex. Well, as we were saying, we were on board for two days. We feel like we still haven't scratched the surface of what this amazing cruise ship has to offer. So with that, we're gonna catch up with Valerie Murphy from Celebrity Cruises, and she's gonna tell us a little bit more about the amazing facilities here on board. So Val, thanks so much for inviting me on Celebrity Beyond today. Delighted to have you here, Shane. It's great that you can join us. And I think last time I met you, well, last time you were on one of our ships, it was Edge. Yeah. So the ship, as you can notice, is a bit different um, to Edge, so. Yeah, I've been absolutely blown away. Like you've taken the Edge concept and took it to a whole new level. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. So tell us, recently enough, um, Celebrity moved to a kind of a more all-inclusive basis. So can you talk to us a little bit about that and what's kind of included? Yeah. So we introduced um, Always Included. So with Always Included, your drinks, your tips and your Wi-Fi are included regardless of what stateroom you're in. So if you're inside, ocean view, balcony, you always have your tips, your drinks and your Wi-Fi included. Now, if you're staying in a suite, which is our retreat proposition, which is where we are today, um, you'll get the premium drinks and you also get stream Wi-Fi um, and onboard credit as well. And uh, then obviously if you're staying in suite, you also get access to uh, Luminae, which is the exclusive restaurant for our suite class guests. You get access to this beautiful retreat sun deck. And um, also then there's a the retreat lounge as well, which is open 24 seven, concierge service there. So literally they look after everything that you need there. Brilliant, brilliant. And I suppose a lot of the trade would be quite familiar with say Celebrity Edge. So what are the, maybe the, the different things that Beyond offers? Well, what we did with um, Beyond is we actually stretched her. So she's 20 meters longer uh, than Edge, which gives us the opportunity to have more space for people. So we have the rooftop garden, um, which people would be familiar with. But what we've done is we've actually put these two amazing cantilever float pools on the side of the rooftop garden. So you can swim out six feet over the side and look out to sea, so you actually feel like you're nearly in the ocean. Yeah, it's it's incredible. Like it is, it is, it is on, on the side of the ship. Um, we've also then totally redesigned the Sunset Bar. I mean, the Sunset Bar is one of the most favorite places on the ship because people love to sit there. You know, can you imagine like leaving Santorini or somewhere like that and you're having your cocktail in hand, looking out to sea. So with the Sunset Bar, um, we got Nate Berkus, who's an American designer to design it, and it's double the size of um, the previous Sunset Bar, and it's absolutely beautiful. You, you almost feel like you're in a uh, somewhere like in the south of France, one of these very chic, cool places, um, and it's definitely one of the coolest places on the ship to be. Yeah, absolutely. And I think one of my favourite kind of features about kind of say the Edge class ships is the fact that you have those kind of the four dining rooms. So even if you're not 
upgrading to a speciality restaurant, you can still kind of dine in different restaurants every night. We actually have 32 food and um, beverage options on the ship, so with, with Beyond and with The Edge and Apex, we have four main dining, so we have Tuscan, Normandy, Cyprus and Cosmopolitan, so they're all slightly different themed. 75% of the menu is the same in each of the restaurants and then 25% is different. So Normandy is our French inspired restaurant, uh, Cyprus is Greek, mm -hmm. um, Tuscan is the Italian and then uh, Cosmopolitan would be international. And the great thing is because these restaurants are smaller, you do feel like you're going to a different restaurant yeah, yeah. every evening without the speciality. Now we do have eight speciality mm -hmm. restaurants. Um, and they range from like $55 up to I think it's possibly $80 for Dining on the Edge. And they're at some incredible, incredible speciality restaurants. And is there a new speciality restaurant that's just on Beyond? There or? is. Um, we have Daniel Belude, who is our um, Michelin chef, who is responsible for the menus. And he has opened his first restaurant at sea called Le Voyage. Mm -hmm. And it's a tasting menu and it is located in the Grand Plaza, just up the steps from the Martini Bar. Again, the Grand Plaza is the heart of the ship. Mm -hmm. We have moved the Martini Bar, used to be up to the side. You would have remembered the Martini Bar. <laughs> yeah. um, and I it's, never visited. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and it's now in the centre. Um, and at night, as you have experienced, mm -hmm. Shane, yeah. it is hopping. We also do an LED light show there as well. It's absolutely a stunning place. And we have a lot of speciality restaurants for deck you know, four and five over the martini bar and it, you can sit there and you can look and see all the action that's going on. There's music there in the evening. There is just so much to offer our guests. And then when you talk about music, the theatre, I mean, you were at the show last night. It's incredible. Unbelievable. Mm. We have like 20 foot high LED screens. So we combine, you know, the te technology with the different, the singing, the aerobatics. It was just an amazing show. It, it, it kind of really nearly takes you off guard every time I kind of go cruising. Yeah. When you see the, the standard of the food, you know, now you're all inclusive, you're getting your drinks, the entertainment, you know, it, it's just unbelievable the, the kind of the value it offers. It is really good value for money and, and I think that's the message with the Always Included, as I said, regardless of what sailing you're going on, what cabin, it is always included, so there is great value. And I think people, they want a really good experience, yeah. but they're happy to pay if they feel there's value for money. Yeah, and it's yeah. definitely all about the value with celebrity. Exactly. And, and for those that want, you know, the, I suppose, the super premium type drinks, you can kind of upgrade to another tier, is you it? You can, yeah. So we have, there's always included, which is the basic. Then you can upgrade to Elevate. And so for it's an extra 24 euro per person per day, you can upgrade and you can get the premium drinks and you also get onboard credit as well. So it's, it's really good, really good value. Val, thanks so much for taking the time out. I know you're incredibly busy over the last two days. Hopefully we'll see you on board soon for your own holidays. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks so much, Val. Thank you.